2171. It's been 150 years since a cataclysmic nuclear disaster plunged our world into chaos. When we started our settlement, we had nothing. We had to set up a reliable water supply line first in order to survive. And with the help of our people, we were able to achieve this vital milestone in no time. There were quite a few hungry mouths to feed. And to provide sustenance, some went hunting. Some tried their luck at fishing, while others became farmers and opted for agriculture. Now that the foundations for a bright future have been laid, we set up a central hearth to strengthen communal spirit and build houses to cater to everyone's privacy. We even acquired the skills and resources to craft tools, cut and sew protective clothing, educate our kids, and gather herbs to keep ourselves healthy. Despite all that, laying out our cemetery was still inevitable. Rest in peace to all the dear departed. The solar collector combined with huge batteries is efficient enough to power our homes, even at night. And today, we are going to make history when a group of valiant people sets off on an expedition, a journey into the unknown. And off they go. Farewell, my friends. Survival. Is it enough to simply get by? Or does it mean pushing yourself and others to overcome anything that life throws at you? engineers, masters of construction and design in the harshest environments known to humankind. We are innovators. We are explorers. Where others see problems, we see potential. We see opportunities.
protect the people at a minute's notice. And decide our own future. Poor man out of time. But Paul's not lost. This campaign will be costly. But in the end, we will be saving humankind from its worst enemy. Itself. So where is it, huh? This institute. How do I get there? Haven't you been paying attention? You don't find the institute. The institute finds you. Foundations is the space sim with the most possibilities of things to do in space. The biggest sandbox this side of the galaxy just got bigger, so to say. Yes, you can fly almost every ship in the universe, personally. From small fighters with a two-man crew with you as the pilot, to huge carriers that can be home to an entire fleet. You can walk around the bridge, give orders to ships via the map interface, and watch the crew develop better skills. Or you can simply go to the captain's console and steer the ship yourself. X4 plays years after the previous X games. There have been a great number of incidents that have led to massive changes in the X universe over only a few decades. Entire civilizations disconnected from their home worlds, past origins forgotten, a huge crisis for most. But from where X4 Foundation starts, you have a glimpse into a possibly brighter future, and you, the player, have the chance to shape it. That is because X4 features a completely dynamic universe, the economy as well as universe structure and political alliances are all dynamic. Instead of a pre-designed linear plot, the game even has a wider variety of procedurally adapted stories. This is the reason why we can comfortably say it is the biggest sandbox, not just because of the literal size of the universe, but because of that level of influence that you as the player can have on that universe. So no matter whether you prefer trade, fight, build, or the many mission chains, you will find something worth investing yourself in. If you want, you can cycle through the many playstyles. Do you build large fleets to launch your own wars instead of just participating in the war missions of the NPC factions? Or do you invest in creating an ever larger self-supporting economy, become a rich mogul and try to personally protect your empire from competition and enemies? 
enemies which become more numerous should you choose a more pirate focused style of gameplay? Or do you follow the mission chains and subscribe to more faction jobs, be it police activity or as a pirate? Be it a war mission or the story surrounding the very special player HQ? Fellow Tropicans, thanks to me, Tropico is an undisputed paradise. I will bring diversity, culture, and the wonders of the world to Tropico! New means of transportation will offer great opportunities of exchange to you and our visitors. I will make Tropico even greater and even better. Vote for El Presidente! Escape the dreams of falling by solving puzzles using only your wits and physics. Human with zero superpowers, given the right tools, can do a lot. Misusing the tools, he can do even more. Explore surreal dreamscapes. Riddled with puzzles and distractions. A game where every rule can be bent and every solution is welcome. Will you try to open that mysterious door? Or would you rather see how far you can throw a speaker set out the window? Human Fall Flat.